What's up guys? We're live here at Pro Play Games with Lexi and she's got a deck that she wanted to profile. What were you playing? Um, Invoked Wind Witch. Cool, and how'd you do with the deck? Like, what's your experience well, with it? Well, yesterday I played like my first locals, so, and I got top four, so I topped four. So that's not bad, like pretty good. That's and, pretty like, good. I've only been playing for like three months, so I made pretty good progress. Yeah. Okay, let's check it out. Okay, so, I played three of my Mr. Crawley. <laughs> Two of my, you know, my wife is the my crystal wing. Then two of the ugly sisters and one chicken egg. So I don't play artifacts because like True Draco's coming out and I just think it's pointless because like they don't really go into their extra deck, so it's like I think it's like pointless to play now. So I play my own little spicy tech of zoo. So I play um, three um, speedroid teratops. And also a cool play that you can do with this is like if you have this and then you draw one of these, you can special summon this and then normal summon, and you can search for the egg, and then you can still make. Oh, still that's make right. Summon. Yeah, true, true. Because so, it is a win. Yeah. yeah. So it's cool. Like with the next level plays. Right. And then your everybody's favorite brick. <laughs> the one and the only brick. And then um, one whip tail for dragon. Then I play a maxi, but French has to be French. Oh my god, that's amazing. It's my favorite yeah. maxi. And then I play three, I am mean, four kaijus, so. I mean, I like playing it because it has like different, all different attributes for like my invocation and stuff, so I can get like mecha buff or light and everything. And also I'm playing it because um, the new masterpiece is coming out, so like kaiju, because it's like unaffected by everything. So, you know, it's always good. And then, okay, so. Two terraforming and three magical meltdown. So I think it's like the correct ratio, because when I was running so, um, three terraforming and three of these I was drawing into like both of them too much so it was just like too bricky and then three of my summoning jutsu <laughs> summoning jutsu nice it does it does summon it does summon a dude a big dude actually very annoying dudes and then I um, run two wonder ones so I think you should keep it at two because with three drawing it it's just like and then two kaiju slumbers. So I really like running it. I was actually signing it, but I decided to, when I was like signing it and stuff, I liked how it was running when I was like putting it in together. So I decided to do it because I like how it like board wipes and everything. It's really good. It's really helpful. And then I run, run uh, Raigeki, Orbin and Chalice, and a Book of Moon. So um, I like these because if you go second, like it's like you don't really lose. Like you have a lot of like outs and stuff. So like if you lose a die roll, like I don't want to be like, oh shit, like I'm going second. So yeah, they really help a lot. And then you know, two twin twisters, and then a strike, two strikes, and then solemn warning, and two lost wins. Um, lost How do you like wins? lost wins? Uh, I love lost wins. It's actually so good because like you flip it and then it goes, when it's in the graveyard, when they summon a monster from your extra deck, you can bring it back and place it down. So it's like really helpful and it works really good. So it's like one of my favorite cards. So. Cool. So that's it for the main deck. Yes. How many cards do you play? Like 40? Yes. Okay, cool. So, my extra deck, I run obviously Crystal Wing, Clear Wing, and then my Winter Bell. Um, Totem Bird, so in case they have like a lot of traps or cards set, I can detach two. Um, Invoker and Borbo and Dryden. Borbo, I just run it so it has Dryden has more material. Um, I run two invoked um, Rygens. And I run this one, but I was thinking I ran it like for like paleo matchups since it's like water, but I was thinking since like people like aren't really playing paleo as much as like it used like they used to be to take it out and then do another Rygen, so I'm not really sure yet. Yeah, maybe after so, the new set comes yeah. out, take it out. So, um, one Mechaba, one of these, so against Zoo, I can just like banish their rat, so I don't have it in the graveyard. Then one of the Kalibas, it's, it's not the best, but it's not bad, so if like you draw two Aliesters, you can just pitch one for the invocation, and um, one monster can only attack each, and then everything, so. One Elysium, so it's really good because you get it and like you banish all their cards without like targeting or anything, so it's really good, and then you can add like OTK. Okay. So this one you can OTK with the fire one. 
Oh, I hate that so, card. Yeah. It's the worst against but Infernoids. But it's so good. Oh, yeah, God. you can like banish for like Dino deck, like the miscellaneous or whatever. So it's super good. And yeah, so that's my extra deck. Nice. Um, okay, and I. Just... Yeah, let's do side deck. Okay, so I just run Ghost Ogre, DD Crow. I used the main DD Crow, but I took it out. But it's so good, so I always side him. Um, an art one artifact Lancia for like the dinos or anything like banish and if they want to like banish bring out the big guy I can just um, throw it to the graveyard and then one ram ram so if they have a lot of back row um, one of them so I can target one monster on field current back in the hand one storming one quaking um, I do three royal decrees for that paleo matchup yeah. Another Forbidden Chalice, because I mean the card's so good, so. Two Dark Hole, because I mean why not, you know. And then two Breakthrough Skills. So I'm doing it so when um, the True Draco comes out, um, Lost Wind like, won't really af like, affect them because they rely on normal summoning and stuff. So I would switch them out for Lost Winds and run it because I mean this is so good against it, so. All right, cool. So what's your experience with the deck? Are you going to keep playing it after the new set, or are you going to make um, uh, No, yeah, else? I'm going to keep playing it and see like how it does and everything. So, uh, but I really like it, so I like playing it. It's fun. Right, well, congrats on learning, picking up, mastering a new deck so fast. Nice. And I uh, can't wait to see what you play yeah, next. Thank you. Peace. Bye.